I'm Todd Grisham. Welcome to the one and only Empire Fight Camp. Alongside me, former world champion Johnny Nelson. About time to. It's time for our tale of the tape. Alexander. Alexander. Tommy the Duke Morrison, the former WBO heavyweight champion of the world. Who could forget some of his legend? This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner, here is the Olympic gold medal. You've heard of people dancing underneath the moonlight tonight? It's a fight underneath the moonlight, and what a fight it should be. You can hear the noise, you can hear the fun. I... He waited a long time, and now we've got this fight. One moment changes everything, especially in this division. By the way, the connect percentages have to be off the charts. Jab to the body, trying to wear him down. They exchange punches. Have you ever danced with the devil under the pale moonlight? That's what these two men are about to go through as they've been talking so much trash on social media, it's time to settle the score. Halfway through the round, and man, these two are going at it. Missed him with that uppercut. Fighters are made for one another. And a counter left. He just gets out of the way of that right uppercut. Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. That left counter punch is score. Talk about a one-sided three minutes. We just saw it. As long as they don't get complacent, you think this is too easy. And there's the bell for round two. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Counter puncher is going to wait for you to move first and then will strike like a snake. Keep an eye on this guy. Reaction is second to none. It's the blink of an eye, and they're waiting for any little what you do. So you've got to fight a counter puncher smart. Nice counter shot. That left shot lands. Courage on display here is incredible. This has been a very competitive round between these two. Lucky to have avoided that left uppercut. Fighter told us yesterday, if he doesn't win by knockout, he doesn't consider it a real victory. That's the mentality he has. Tactics out of the window. These guys just want to brawl. Neither man really defending themselves. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. And a round that's 
seemed like an eternity for them finally comes to a close. The bell sometimes. Let's get it started in round three. Safe to say that last round was a nightmare. Let's see if we can turn it around here. That was a tough last round. Now you've got to make sure he doesn't put it on him. That's what he's going to try and do. So tie him up, hold him, lean on him. Don't get drawn into a fight. Not yet, not until your senses have come back. Let's see if these two heavyweights decide to exchange bombs early or decide to box a little bit. Guys that carry so much power, of course they're going to look for that knockout because it makes a night a little bit shorter. You don't get paid any extra for overtime. It has been a back and forth contest so far, no doubt about it. And he just misses with that jab. He blocks the right uppercut. He misses with that jab. You can tell he's stronger, but he's not faster. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. At this point, you got to believe he can't win on the scorecards. Going to need it. Here's the bell for round four. It has been all one-way traffic. How do they turn this around? They've had one minute to recover. Now they've got to bluff it. They've got to bluff it. They've got to come out now and style it out. Get on the back foot, jab. Rest on the jab. Be smart and pop until your legs come back. Then put the pressure on. famous boxing movies, the training scenes, the gym work, that's what it all boils down to. Who's going to have more endurance? What can they change? Can they slow the pace down? Can they help them to, to knock them out early? What can they do? They've got to concentrate and relax because you know what you can do in the gym. You can do it in the fact they've got to relax. You've heard the phrase, finding a second win. I don't think I need to tell you which one of these fighters needs to find it. This fight a little bit closer than I think a lot of people thought. And he misses with that jab. Energy and endurance are not an issue for this fighter who continues to be aggressive as the rounds wear on. How do you deal with an aggressive fighter? What you do is you fight, fire, we fight. You either give it and back because that's where they're comfortable, or you play calm, play cool. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. He is down big time on the score. You're absolutely exhausted. What are you going to tell him in the corner? And here's the bell to start round five. Well, they got battered last round. How do they turn their fortunes around? They both want the knockout. Better start respecting each other's punching power. <laughs> it's 
someone's will will cave, but which fighter will it be? Power is obviously the great equalizer in boxing, but when you know your opponent is relying on that so heavily, how do you deal with it? This could be really intimidating, Todd. If you know somebody's got the punch power, someone's got the speed, someone can take you out with a simple jab, it can be intimidating. It just depends on how confident you are as a fighter. Halfway through the round, and there's not a lot separating these two. are made for one another. And he misses with the left uppercut. A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. Well, he is glad to have heard that bell. Needs a knockout without a doubt. Needs to go out there and think, right, you know what? Next round, you're getting it. You're getting it. Kitchen sink. Nice round. Good round. I like that. Let's start the six. Safe to say. So there you have it. It is official now, and that is not the way anyone wanted this fight to end. No complaints there at all. The crowd agree. I agree. The ref knew exactly what he was doing. So you know what? Great shout. I look forward to fight number two.